keep low. We don't want to be the cause of this collapsing. That's really cool. Uh, to get a bit higher. Now oh, that's killing me. If we start seeing bubbles like this, that's what we're going to be careful. Let's go, let's go. So, here's myself and uh, and Dean. How's it going? Make sure you check him out on uh, on YouTube. I'm gonna leave uh, the link to his channel in the description. Uh, Dean Explores. That's yeah. the one, is it? So, he's got some locals uh, explores around his area here of uh, Staffordshire that are really worth a watch. So don't miss them out, please. Make sure you give him the thumbs up and a follow. So let's get in, see what uh, this old. Uh, color he's got to give um you came across this place really has a has a bit of a chance or yeah. research i just saw the sound print in the drainage here and thought well the water's got to be coming from somewhere <laughs> yeah so and uh we very much doubt that many people if anyone has been yeah. in because it was properly blocked with uh razor barbed wire originally yeah. was it right so let's go in this milk is sort of uh streaks underneath yeah. uh, <laughs> I'm not sure what this is all about, but if we start seeing bubbles like this, that's what we're going to be careful. So we've got the, we've got the gas monitor with us and anything that uh, is going, any gases then is going to alert us. Yeah. But as you can see here, we're going into a bricked added tunnel. And I imagine this would have been the main haulage system for this uh, mine. Oh, big dip here. Watch out. Wow. Uh, are we going straight into into shale? But uh, the shale is very expected here, isn't it? Really, because all Staffordshire, most of Staffordshire, is uh, has been laid in beds of very ancient shale but oh my god look at this 20.0 he's dropping already i don't think we're going to get very far you know but so what's the danger level 16.5 is set uh i would say go to one side yeah okay and very slowly and it's no joke actually it's uh, the oxygen is steady There's quite a bit of silk here, so take some steady steps to make sure we don't uh, fall through any, any hidden dangers. 20 points or Solid ground. Oh, That's what we gotta watch out for. So steady steps okay here. One feel feel every step as you go. Let's see here. We have a portal here and uh, the mine goes. So He might have had yeah, some sort of portal gate. Twenty point four, so the air is actually quite good, which is telling me that uh, there might be a shaft somewhere along here. 
a ventilation shaft we're quite normally used. You can see a bit of a rotten timber that's just really it's lost its purpose because it's not even touching the, the roof. So we come to a first collapse of shale which is quite expected it goes on straight ahead it goes on to the left and to the right oh my god take your time because as we can see a lot of this shale is yeah. delaminated so if you touch it there's potential for collapse so keep as low as you can there's a lot that's come down i'm not very surprised about or concerned about uh, you know rock falls because they are <laughs> they are pretty normal everywhere we go it's all right just keep low we don't want to be the cause of this collapsing if it's gonna go you know what i mean and uh right there is the narrowest constriction so he's gonna have to negotiate it very carefully really i'm not gonna feel myself going through because i want to pay full attention to what i'm doing but after that basically it opens up yeah well that's good news so let's go and see the where this goes as i say we do this safely we got the gas monitors we know the way out and we got a call out so let's do this as soon as we've gone through we can see some of the original timber there supporting as uh there's up another level up here i think i think this was the coal seam you know oh yeah i think this band here that, that you can see Right there, that, that is the coal seam. Oh yeah. I mean, it's, it's very thin and looks a bit poor quality, but I might be wrong. It could be, it could have been a private mine, don't it? Don't it? Yeah. That's why it's not as... So you can see up there. 19.9 oh. oxygen, yeah. so... Oh, wow. So we have right here, one of the original coal miners board. Oh wow, what, what. It's in quite a good state. Uh, they would have had hobnails like the old, or, like the old uh, lead miners boots, you know, which give added grip. So this is this gives us a reminder what this place was all about. You know, men working down here in very basic equipment, and you know, I guess the shoes did the job. The leather, they still uh, haven't. Fully fallen, fallen apart, have they? Nope. That's really cool. Whenever you see a collapse like the one we've gone through, obviously over there, you could expect some backing up of water, which is the case here. We're gonna have to just go slow, go slowly. I would say stick to one side. Well, it's very deep end. <laughs> and see where this goes, yeah? Yeah. This is marvellous, I have to say. Really is. Marvellous, yeah, freezing. <laughs> I think uh, the water's gonna get deeper. Yeah. So we gotta kind of prepare for that. So, actually I'm getting uh, Deep below the way this. Wow, it's quite a, it's spectacular to see. 19.1. Let's see how far we can, how far we are willing to go, really. That's the ultimate answer. How much we want to go depends. If it's got to get any deeper or not, uh, it's uh, shallowing out a tiny bit. 
and we're gonna keep an eye on the oxygen 19.1 we are good and just basically make sure we look at the bottom that there's no hidden shafts or dangers we don't really want to destroy him the air feels reassuringly very clear I can see like the remains of a uh, cross slippers there uh, you're gonna be missing them and actually wow there you are so we have cross slippers this level is actually magnificent you have the original slippers here Uh, which is reassuring because it means we are walking on the actual ground level however we are going to be keeping our eye we are coming to a small scale collapse here and we rejoin the the original sleepers the oxygen is 18.9 so there it is it is dropping the oxygen ever so slightly seems to be but we are going to be going slowly oxygen steady at 18.9 as and it's going as far as i can see i think I can see the end of the water there. Oh yeah. See the original sleepers where the rails yeah. and the car would have been running on. You go slowly, take your time and film when you And now uh, it's shallow enough. That's always very good news for us. You can see the original one of the previous watermarks uh, where the water was originally right there, very clear we seem to be coming to a close Of the original ventilation, uh, I, I imagine it would have helped control ventilation, but like a passing gate as well. And you can see some of the amazing calcifications that you can get here as well. You got a calcified fly there. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's reassuring the flies uh, might have come all this way here. Yeah, it is kind of a fly or spider, more like a fly, I think. And I think. We are coming to the end. So I think I meant some gates in it. Hey? So I meant some gates with the pins here. Oh wow, yes, remains of the original gate with the actual pins. That's always impressive to see. Is that a shot hole there as well? Yeah. Yeah, original shot hole which tells you the, the, the direction they drove the level in. Obviously, they were driving inwards from the hillside that we enter. And, oh, that could be, could be the end of this. Oh, there's interesting kind of uh, bedding, like gray sort of bedding. It looks more like the, like a toadstone, like a volcanic rock that you find in Derbyshire. It's got this sort of grey colour. And as I can see... Oh wow. There's some implants. I'm, I'm pretty sure these are fairly modern, you know. Yeah. I'm sure someone's had a digging project here. Yeah. These are not coal mining times, I wouldn't think. They look to be too plastic based and obviously you look at the buckets. I know what's happened. 
they probably have installed a drainage to be able to explore it further yeah look yeah that's what it is they dug through the collapse and they installed some drainage very good idea well, that's gonna take a look over there we're on 19.3 oxygen so we pretty safe and you can see all this uh, kind of very precarious shaley rock all the trouble that's caused here uh, all this collapse it, I would almost say like it looks like the volcanic rock that we found in Derbyshire with that grey sort of colour but I can't see it being uh, volcanic here oh look I think this is original miners. Yeah. Big right. mattock here. I'll be off in a second. Right, yes, this is, I would dare to say, original miners, most likely. Well, leave it where it belongs. Shopping batteries. We're going to take a look at what's down here. But, as what you guys can see, this is basically oh let's go let's go 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 So while I was off camera then just as you can hear Antonio is right along. What is it? Low oxygen? Low oxygen. Low oxygen. <laughs> <laughs> just over. Over the collapse that we've been looking down where if you were to look down on the other side, you see the water level is right to the neck as soon as I set, set foot there the alarm went off and it went straight to down 10% so it goes to show you have to take serious precautions down here and you need to carry the right equipment you got some footage of that yeah? I sure have okay so we're gonna make the way back to the over the collapse and explore the two side levels that we've seen on each side, yeah? Yeah, sounds good to me. Okay. So we're going back to the main crossroads. Does that go? Oh, yeah. We're back on the crossroads. Uh, and we, we are turning right from the way we came in and have a good explore. See what we can find here. Let's see, uh, Dean has made his way on, but as you can see, it's very, it's very shaly and crumbly everywhere. Hey, some good stuff. Uh, now we can see. Wow. I uh, think this has been flooded at one time. Uh, wow, the colors of this. And we come to what looks to be like a... They build a wall here. And uh, and it carries on up there, doesn't it? Yeah. Wow. Wow. It's a bit gnarly, I think I'm gonna pass. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Almost feels a little bit hard to breathe there as well. Yeah. Yeah, confined spaces. The thing is we if we come across bad oxygen, getting out there quick is gonna be difficult. We're gonna stick to the fairly easy accessible levels. Saying that. Uh, now it goes. 
why she'll never touch the water with her eyes because it's just like it's very spongy, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, very. So I guess that was holding the roof up here somewhere, but I'm sure it was. This was holding the roof at one point, but it's lost its purpose altogether. Yeah. Well, you go ahead. I'll get some perspective of you. Yeah, this was cold seam, definitely. Wow, some crazy stuff there. Yeah. I think these are... Uh... No, they are stalactites, I shouldn't have touched them. The ones that are sort of... No, that's a snow tide. That's kind of a snow tide. Can you see how it's yeah. bouncing away? Which is uh, microorganisms, basically. Wow. Quite spectacular this. Indeed. We're getting hands and knees here. There we go, we've got something there. Uh, sort of like that alien stuff there in the last. It's sort of like a dandelion cloth, but it's like something growing in the water. That is a sort of uh, fungus, actually, yeah. You could say, yeah, definitely fungal, very interesting indeed, the alien life that uh, grows down here, you could say. Oh, we've got something there. Keeps going. Moth. I'll let you make your way. Uh, formations here, look at this. Wow. and uh, they are red from the content of iron in the rock hey yeah it comes to a dead end so I am guessing this was the this was the coal they took out here this was a seam of coal how colourful this is. A lot of uh, yellow, yellow from sulphur as well. And it's like a dead go, but... Yeah. Definitely a collapse. We're not going to get through there. No. So we're going to inspect the other end. The second tunnel. And now we're going to go to the left. Yeah, I'll go first. Straight away we can see some more rotting timbers. Originally they would have supported quite a lot of, quite a lot of this uh, shale that has collapsed, as we can see. Wow. We are going in a bit of water here, but this continues. And again, it seems, I think they were working on this seam. I think this was the, the seam of coal they were working. Because can you see, can you see the incline follows along the seam there? Yeah, the incline. The this on. this got to be a very old coal mine, unless we was like a very local sort of venture that we're exploiting some of this lower quality coal. I mean, it looks very soft for us, but I might be wrong. It might have been good to them. I don't know what this is. Wow. 
Wow. This is so funny, alien. <laughs> Go follow that call soon. Spectacularly colourful, is it? Eh? Oh yeah, it's spectacularly colourful. Ah. Yeah, I'll let you overtake me if that's all right. Yeah. You know, now it's got that gate on. I might just name it back all night. Oh, wow, some proper nice colours here. Timber holding up there. Marvelous formations here, as you can see, guys. The colors are absolutely stunning, are they? All this sulfur and reds and uh, calcite here oh there's a bit of a timber prop there and uh and an old uh, pack wall where well, they were definitely following this call scene were they definitely yeah well, this is uh much longer goes a much longer way than the other one we've been. Wow. Look at the colours. Wonderful. We've come to a timber, a tight timber. Original minus prop. We have to prop the seam of the uh, Wow, look at this. That's got a nail as well. <laughs> I just wanted to get a bit higher. My oh, back's killing me. Yeah, it would be ideal if it's deeper. Another timber and uh, and the seams, the seam of coal. You can see very clearly how they follow it on an incline. It goes. Wow. Yes. What's that? That's all, actually. Wow. So an explorer has lost his torch. <laughs> so someone's been here before us. Very obviously, but are we the first one recording this place? That's the big difference. If anyone's lost a torch, you know where it is. Still going. Wow, it's just so nice to see some of this clear water, but as we go, obviously, we make it murky. Wow. It's a big mine, isn't it? Oh, definitely. There's a lot of that there, yeah. Wow, look at all this timbering they, they use here. It's marvellous. All timber. And then again, you look up there, 
and it's and they walled it so they must have gone so far and then blocked the access for some reason you know yeah unless it's over adding to the and it's come down into it yeah It's marvellous. Keeps going on and on and on. We're going to go as far as the oxygen allows, allows us to. Hey. Yeah. So we got into a shell collapse and uh, And more timber and a way up there that's been blocked I think that's the end is it? yeah we get on to more of that, um, that brittle stuff there yeah tell me if it goes it looks like it might go it might go let's have a look it goes. So just when you think you come to the end and it still goes. This is incredible. Should we take five here? Let's take five minutes just to gather ourselves a bit, take a breath. Okay? okay. If we can get down, that is. Oh, it's a bit precarious, this. <laughs> From what I can see, anyway, it doesn't look. Oh, no, it's not worth it, that's not. It goes to that bit and then it's blocked off there. Okay. So, yeah? Yeah. That's the end of this one. I don't know if you want to have a quick look. Yeah. I can see, yeah, it's, uh, it's running. Yeah, it looks pretty bad. So, that's it for this one, then. Yeah. It's been surprisingly, you know, big with quite a lot of features. It's always good to, good to explore these places, isn't it, buddy? Definitely. Yeah, so make sure you subscribe to Dean's channel. As I said, I'm going to leave the, the link to, to his uh, channel in the description. And we'll see you on another adventure. I'm sure we'll hook up sometime soon. Definitely. Find yeah. some more places on the ground. Well, yeah, plenty to see. So thank you, guys, and take care. All the best. See you later, guys.